Hey guys, what's up? So I just wanted to do a quick video on what to look for if you're suspecting an antifreeze leak in your vehicle. Okay, so if you notice the antifreeze fluid level going down in your overflow reservoir, uh, and you suspect that there's a fluid leak somewhere, uh, on the antifreeze side of things, you're gonna check your radiator hoses, make sure they're not dripping underneath, that there's no fluid coming out of them. You know, if you have a, a leak and it's like right around here, right where the, you know, the collar is, the, um, if it's around where the clamp is, you might just need a new clamp. Uh, you may want to try to swap that out. You'll have all the hose to the other end, make sure it's not leaking on the other end. Make sure everything's okay and nice and dry. And uh, you'll come around, look at your heater core hoses. Mine are down here, they're not leaking. Uh, find out where your, your water pump is and check that. Here's my Jeep and on the water pump in the front, usually like underneath, if they let go, there'll be like a weep hole and um, they'll leak a little bit under there. Typically when a water pump goes, you know, there's a weep hole under it and they'll leak a little bit from there when the, the pump needs to be replaced. Also, check your thermostat housing, uh, where it meets to the housing. This one's nice and dry, but if you were experiencing a leak or losing some fluid out of there, it may be wet all around the bottom here. Uh, these plastic housings up here do crack over time because of the heat that they're subject to. Also check out your radiator, make sure there's no holes in it. Uh, check out the bottom, make sure it's not wet around the bottom where you might be losing leak, um, some antifreeze out of that. Uh, especially around the petcock area, there should be a little petcock around the bottom. They can leak once in a while and um, you might lose some fluid out of that too. If all your hoses check out good, uh, your heater hoses check out good, you know, wherever your water pump's located, check that on, on your vehicle, make sure that's nice and dry underneath and that looks good. Um, the, the thermostat housing like I just showed you on the Jeep, uh, you know, if you, if you keep losing some fluid, check out the reservoir itself. Make sure there's no cracks in there. Feel underneath, make sure it's all nice and dry and uh, you can't visibly see anything leaking because, you know, they, they break too. They're plastic and they can crack and uh, you can lose fluid that way as well. So those are a few quick things to check right off the bat without diving too deep. Um, if it's leaking that bad, usually you'll see a puddle underneath the car. Look for something green and... Um, kind of look above the puddle and that should pinpoint the location as to where the leak is coming from and i hope you guys hope this helps you guys out leave a comment if you have any questions uh, like the video if you liked it and don't forget to subscribe to the channel thanks for watching